are going to do a simple beach towel. Here's beach towel. The tag is on this end, so I want the opposite end to embroider a name. Since there are lines, I'm going to use the lines to help guide where to put it. So we are going to do what they call is floating. Oh, and this has tearaway stabilizer. I buy mine from Amazon, nice big roll. And this is the spray I use. It's kind of pricey, but there's, there's other ones you can use. I just have a hard time trusting any others. So I am gonna spray this, uh, spray it, cause I like to float everything. A little bit of spray goes a long way. Um, you fold it in half, fold it in half, put it there. Then you open it up. There we go. Oh. This is for a gift for a young lady. I snagged that with my ring. It won't hurt it though. All right, so I use the line to help guide because I want her name to float here. My Lily has picked out to put her friend's name in light pink right here. So this is ready to go to the machine already. It's really simple, towels are fun and very easy. Okay, so this is a Janome 550E and I am going to run to make sure that it is within area. In other words, I frame it. Make sure that everything's in frame, which it is. All right. I put it on my machine. Since Janome has her arm on the inside, I put it on my machine like this because it's less weighing on the arm. And the rest is sitting here on the table next to it. And it's, it's loose, so it can move with it. So everything's all right. I put a piece of water soluble stabilizer on it. And this is the kind I use, Solvi. But I do use other kind from Amazon when I do get around to ordering it. But this is the kind I'm using today. It's from the Sulky brand. All right, you guys. See, we're gonna put the name Sky on there and it's facing that way. So it starts the top of the name up here and ends down here. Um, there we go. I have it centered into the bottom of this and there's that. Oh, I was gonna, I like to put little tiny pieces of tape to help keep my stabilizer in place. My water soluble. There's all kinds of methods of doing it. This is how I do it. So here we go, you guys. I have light pink already in it, so it should be ready to go. Put her foot down, push start, and there we go.
guys, here it is. It is done. So first things first, pull this all off. All the water soluble stabilizer. Just in case you didn't know what water soluble stabilizer is for or why is it important, especially on towels or deep pile fabrics. It's to keep your, your stitches from being lost within the fabric. Here we go. That looks pretty cool. Pop it out of the frame. Sometimes, ooh, sometimes it's a fight. And since it's tear away, you just tear that all off of there. Here we go. Pull it all off. I like to trim these little kind of little guys off where my 550 likes to not likes but she cuts her own threads there we go we will get that taken care of but there you guys go a nice new beach towel for lily's friend sky easy peasy took 12 minutes even though i sped it up in video for you 12 minutes i ran it at 700 stitches per minute but i'm pretty happy with that you guys thank you for coming and hanging out with me and embroidering with me today let me know if you guys have tried out towels let me know if you like them um, i myself am addicted to towels if you guys have not noticed in my previous videos so thank you for watching please come back again please consider subscribing and keep on crafting Bye.